there is uncertainty of the number of troops each side had. The Normans had between 7,000 and 12,000 troops, the English had between 5,000 and 13,000 troops. Most of the English army was on foot, while about a quarter of the Norman army was actually on horseback. There were actually three claimants for the English throne in 1066. Harold, who became king earlier that year, William, whose grandfather married into the English royal family and who was promised the crown by Edward the Confessor, and Harold Hardrada, whose claim was through the Danish kings of Canute's family. Hardrada also had the support of Harold's estranged and exiled brother Tostig. Hardrada was defeated by Harold less than a month before the Battle of Hastings at the Battle of Stamford Bridge, where both Hardrada and Tostig were killed. The battle lasted all day, from some say about 9am to just before sunset about 6pm. Senlac Hill is the site of the battle about 7 miles north of Hastings. The town of Battle gets its name from the site itself, and an abbey is also at the site in commemoration of the battle. King Harold may not have been killed by an arrow in his eye. It's the famous image in the Bayeux Tapestry, but actually he was more likely to have been killed by being ran down by William's cavalry and basically battered to death. As you can see behind me is Apple House, which I did a video about a few week, a few months ago. Um, as you can see, it's starting to be taken apart, it's starting to be demolished. The company that owns the site has decided to demolish the building. That sort of that sort of crudeness that comes out. Man can be. Yeah, we're seeing you edit your own not like naughtiness out. I bleep it usually. No, you just don't put it in. <laughs> <laughs> That's because I'm clean living. I don't do naughty things. Bye.